This video is about solving questions like this on integration when you have given a modulus of a definite integral. So to solve questions like this, you just have to see the limits and see when the function is negative or positive, just add the sign and then solve the question like you solve a definite integral. So let's check this out. C from minus 1 to 0 x cube minus x is either greater than or equal to 0 and from 0 to 1 this x cube minus x is less than or equal to 0 and from 1 to 2 this function is greater than or equal to 0. So just broken this limit in three parts. Now we just have to expand this limit and solve a definite integral question which will be really easy. Now, so now let's do that. So integration of minus 1 to 2 modulus of x cube minus x dx is equal to now just write these limits minus 1 to 0 plus will be here 0 to 1 and plus will be here 1 to 2. Now write this function and again and again. Now you just have to add a positive and a negative sign. This is greater than 0. This is less than 0. I will add a negative sign here. This is also greater than 0. Now you just have to simply solve this. So now let's solve this. We get x raised to the power 4 by 4, which is x raised to the n integral dx is equal to x raised to the n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 minus x square by 2 using the same formula, adding these limits and now here, if we take this minus sign in here, this will become negative and this will become positive. So x square by 2 minus x raised to the power 4 by 4, 0 to 1. Plus here x raised to the power 4 by 4 minus x square by 2, adding the limits. Now just chunk in the limits, see this upper limit which will be 0 minus lower limit so a minus lower limit minus 1 raised to the power 4 is 1 so 1 by 4 minus minus 1 raised to power 2 is 1 itself so plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4 and upper limit minus lower limit 0 other limit is 0 plus 2 raised to the power 4 which is 16 so 16 by 4 is 4 4 minus 2 square is 4 so 2 4 by 2 is 2 upper limit minus lower limits which is 1 by 4 minus 1 by 2 so now let's solve this further so we get 1 by 2 positive and negative 1 by 4 right? plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4 plus 4 minus 2 is 2 and plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4 now here you can see that this is 1 by 2 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 so 3 by 2 and here minus 1 by 4 minus 1 by 4 and minus 1 by 4 so minus 3 by 4 and you can see a 2 in here which is this now taking the LCM we get 4 down there and here it will become a 6 and here it will be minus 3 and here it will be 8 so 6 minus 3 is 3 plus 8 by 4 which is 11 by 4 so this is the answer so its value is 11 by 4. So this is how you solve questions like this in integration. So thanks for watching this video and always remember that math is everything.